Hi, this is your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk guy, Nathan. We're going to be reviewing Earth Defense today on FX2. Uh, please look for our review under the description of the video on YouTube. Please like, share, follow us, as well as subscribe to Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. Anyway, let's go ahead and get this uh, review underway, shall we? Pretty fun looking table right off the bat. That ramp right there, as you can tell, the ramp is actually a little bit higher. So I'd say uh, just from the, the blocks in the middle right there and the ramp height, moderate gameplay. So far it's moderate to low, although the ramps and stuff are, are high. So you need a little bit of ball speed to get up there. Good music so far. Theme's nice, I like all the colors. The, the theme is definitely working for me. Paddle gap isn't too bad if you notice they're a little further apart. But still not not super difficult. Table mechanics, awesome. Look at the layering on this. I mean you got front of table, mid table, and then back of tables built up. Got a lot of stuff going on on this pinball. And that's what you get if you just saw me. I put my flippers up and I kept the ball in. That's what you get with a little bit of a moderate to low level table in regards to difficulty as you can save the ball and most harder tables with the paddle gap being a little further apart, you lose that ball almost immediately. Get ready! Pretty fun game so far. It's uh, it's enjoyable. Most of these Zen pinballs are. They're pretty fun either way you look at it. If the theme's off a little bit, they're still a fun pinball. As you can see, there are some bumpers and some blocks on the edge of that rail right there. So that ramp right there is a little bit harder to get up on the left side. There it is. Testing that ramp there just to kind of see nice if it's shot. kind of right paddle lower areas where you're going to be able to get up that ramp the easiest. Delta Squad deployed. That ramp, that ramp height definitely has an impact on your ball. As you saw from the left side, it just kicks that ball right back at you. If you don't have that speed, it just puts it right back into the, right down the center on you. And this has got a little bit of a shorter table in the front. It's more built up in the back. 
which means to get you know substantial ball speed, you need to be a little bit further back. So that, that kind of adds to the difficulty a little bit. You see right there, it didn't go all the way out there. I'd say the replayability of this game is pretty high so far. Pretty fun, keeps you engaged. It's easy to combo from what you just saw. Got a million points there. That way you can stack your points up pretty easily on this game. just a fun little game. There's not a whole lot of strategy needed on this one. It's pretty straightforward like Castle Storm you gotta kinda be smart about it. Epic Quest is the same way. This one is just more uh, a casual let's hit the ball as much as we can, make some points and, and just have a good time kinda pinball and uh, it's definitely fun. I like it. The theme and everything kinda carries it through. It, it has everything it needs to be a, a really good uh, pin that you can keep playing over and over again. a good game. If you get a chance to look at Earth Defense, it's uh, worth picking up. Uh, we appreciate you uh, watching our review today. Thank you.